Hey guys, D Mike here for another episode of Super Nintendo Sundays with some more Yoshi's Island. Things got a little froggy last time, so hopefully this time we can just be jamming through the trees. Once again, I have no idea what I'm doing, as per usual. One thing I think I'm doing is potentially making good content, because I have noticed, as I try to be mindful of, oops, not mindful of e losing Mario, but uh, mindful of my channel, I've noticed, especially recently, that there has been a massive uptick of subscribers and views. So I just wanted to go ahead and begin this episode by saying thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you to everybody who's been tuning in lately and will tune in. Still hoping to get that subscriber count up if I can. I remember, uh, oh, no, I shouldn't say I remember. Um, I do believe that the 100 subscriber mark upon achieving such a lofty benchmark will allow me to create a custom URL for my channel. For those of you who aren't aware of what a URL is, when you type it in to YouTube, and just instead of just searching for DMite Plays, which I'm sure is a pretty easy thing to do, I can go and make it youtube.com slash Plays, And that, my friends, is amazing. So for those of you who are tuning in, if you are watching this channel and you haven't yet subscribed, please do so. Trying to get to that 100 mark soon. Really helps me to grow the channel, to continue to make awesome, fun content for all of you, to continue the shenanigans to a high level. That's kind of a goal. But uh, overall, the views are well appreciated. I'm just so excited now that my content is, as bad as it is, is being seen by more people. So thank you once again to everybody who's, oops, who's been along. Oh boy. I was trying to say thank you, Yoshi. Anyway, thank you for everybody that's been along for the ride that's been here from the ground floor. It means a ton to see your views and comments and thoughts. Man, I'm just, <laughs> I'm just getting nuked here. As I'm trying to be thoughtful, the game is just spiking me on these yellow colored pencils. But yes, it's been a blast making all this content and whether it was going to happen now or in the future, I had a feeling that eventually, one day, my content would get to a point that more people would see it. And it makes me super happy and excited to be a part of all of your lives in a little way. You know, maybe it's something as simple as making silly, funny videos on the internet, but hopefully I make your day better and I give you something to enjoy, whether it's, you know, whether you're at home on summer break from school or... Maybe you've had a rough day at work and you come back and I give you something fun to watch while you're trying to decompress. I love the idea of helping people in any way that I possibly can. As I just... Oop. <laughs> I didn't think there was anything down there. There was no ground. But yes. It makes me happy that hopefully I boost someone's mental health during the day. It's a boost to my mental health to make this content. It's very fun for me to come home from a stressful day and to sit down in front of the old computer machine and make this con- Is there anything down here? Ooh, that is no- This is brutal. It's a nice juxtaposition for me trying to be grateful. The game was like, not grateful for you though. I'm grateful for everybody that I'm making content for, but the game is not grateful for me playing it. That's okay. I can't expect to win them all, but yeah, it's just been a lot of fun. I. One of the things that I was kind of nervous about when I started this channel is kind of the the things that had happened to me in my personal life and, you know, in my very brief initial YouTube career. I don't know if I want to even call it that, but um, the kind of downfall of that original channel. Oh, boy. Is there any? Okay. Whew. All right. Now I need to get up to get Mario. Can I get it up? Okay, I can't. But anyway, yeah, the uh, the original downfall of my original channel and uh, just kind of the, the point I was in my life wasn't great to be making content. There had a lot going on and a lot of things that I needed to get right. And 
Ooh, there's a button here. What is this? What is this? Does this coin mean anything? Do these coins mean anything? Does anything mean anything? The nihilist approach to Yoshi's Island. But anyway, yes. I wasn't in a great place in my life, and um, I think it kind of showed in a, in a lot of the later content that I was making. I've gone back and I've watched it a little bit, and it's just not very becoming of who I am. And Oh man, I didn't get the bonus. That's kind of shocking. But what I did get for all of you is another 100 point performance. You're welcome. There it is. And one more level for good measure today. The Cave of Hairy Hedgehog. Hopefully people don't ever ask to see my Hairy Hedgehog. But yeah, I just wasn't in a good place. And I'm very thankful now that I've been able to kind of put the pieces back together in my life and actually have fun with, with these videos and making content. I've said this before, and it might seem kind of like a common sense, whatever kind of blase thing to say. Well, there are hedgehogs in here. But it is incredibly true that if you're making content for whatever reason you choose, if you're making content, whether it's every so often or all the time, if you're not having fun, don't make it. You know, if there's nothing worse than feeling obligated to to create something that you don't believe in. That's always a bummer. Content creation should be something that is done as a way to have fun and to share a little bit of yourself with other people in a good, meaningful way. So hopefully, for those of you who are also content creators, you're able to do so. I always look forward to, hopefully in the future, being able to collaborate with some of you who are watching my channel in the present. So, to future D-Mike, hope you have a blast with whoever you wind up with. But, yeah, in general, it's been a fun run so far. I know that it's still pretty early in my channel's life, but... I really enjoyed just being able to get back into doing the content that I used to really feel like I thrived in. Now I say that like this channel is very silly and not super serious at all. Not super serious, but in general, my big thing is just to want to make it and to feel good about the product. This isn't like a business or anything, but uh, yet, <laughs> but did I screw myself? I might have. Can I get up there? I don't know if you can... I don't really know what I'm doing. Oh boy. Am I stuck down here now? No, I don't know. I can't go there, so I gotta get on out. Alright. Yeah, like I was saying, is just being willing to make the content and have fun with it. Because that was one of the things that I noticed, like I was saying before. I was making content back in the day, and I wasn't enjoying it. I just wasn't having fun. Can I get up there without the bow wow? Nope. Great. Hope you're ready for some backtracking. But I wasn't really having fun. And if you're not having fun, there's no real value in what you're doing. So hopefully you all can tell in the content that I'm making that I am enjoying myself. I'm having fun making the content, making it my way to a high level. That was my thing back in the day that I always felt I was missing is I didn't have the ability and the resources to really do things the way that I wanted it to look and feel, but I do now. So that's always fun. I'm trying to be creative in what I do and what I say, definitely in what I say. But yes, the main goal overall is just that you all enjoy yourselves and you are able to watch this content as often or as infrequently as you want. You know, there's no, no pressure. But, um, oh my goodness, these hedgehogs are brutal. Just to give you something to enjoy. That's kind of my big thing. All right. So I did see, I did see that key. I don't know how to get to it. Oh, get away from me. I feel like I need it though. Oh, maybe not. Ooh, is this a... Ooh, this reminds me of Super Mario World Just. 
all these coins from like the, the yellow uh, Switch Palace. Super Mario World is one of my favorite games. Okay. <laughs> is that just it? Was there another switch I could have pressed? I wasn't really paying attention. And I feel like those coins are kind of pointless. Can I do it again? Maybe? Wait. I'm gonna get that flower. No. Is this... Okay. So, that's it. You get one shot. One chance to blow, and that's it. Okay, well... It is what it is. I didn't make the best of that, but that's okay. Hmm. All right. Well, I need to get that key somehow. I don't know where exactly that key is gotten from. That's great English. But I will figure it out eventually, or I will use the internet. But yes. Once again, thank you everybody that's been watching stuff on this channel, following along. I don't know where things have taken off or what's really resonating with people, but I'm looking forward to continuing to make content that everybody enjoys. I'm having so much fun just using this as a release for me, just to kind of say goofy things and entertain all of you. While I stare at that big purple mushroom. Okay. What do these do? Oh, these blue oh my goodness. We can shoot fire. That is amazing. I need to figure out how to get that key. It looks like... Can I get up there? No. Okay. Alright, so the key is down there. I need to come out, come out from the left somehow. All right, let's set you guys on fire. You're kind of getting on my nerves. When in doubt, set things on fire. Okay. So let's do a quick reset of this little environment with these varmints in the environment. Okay. No, I'd like to eat you because oh, he's stuck. That's a fun sound that I don't hate at all. Oh my gosh. Ooh, all right. Uh, oh my goodness, why didn't I? <laughs> what did I think was gonna happen? All right, so it looks like I gotta come up on the left side some. I don't know if I can get up any higher. Maybe I can? Okay. It's like this. Ah. Uh, not my best, uh, not my best showing right now. Oh boy, come here. Got him in the nick of time. Let's, uh, let's take a moment and catch our breath here. Who knows? Yeah, that's right, Yoshi. Just take some time and think about what you've done. I don't know if there's, like, a hidden ground here or something that I'm missing. It's not super clear what you're supposed to do. When I saw there was that, um... There's that, there's that guy. But I don't know how to get it, and I can't see it from here. Okay. Doing great. Huh. Yeah, that's really tricky. I gotta get up there somehow. Because you gotta get this key, it looks like, to progress. I'm just spinning the wheels here. Might need to... Wait, 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 wait. Can I use this? Maybe? Mm? Gotta be careful, though. I don't want to push it too hard. Not too hard. Not too hard. Easy, easy. Wait. Ugh. Is that not it? Is that not what you do? It looked very promising. Maybe you gotta ride it all the way, all the way over and I just lost momentum. All right, let's reset this area. I've got a pretty good feeling that's what I'm supposed to do. I need to do a little rock and roll. All right, let's dodge these fellas. Excuse me, gentlemen. 
gentle ladies. Oh my goodness, stop it. All right, we're gonna learn from our mistakes. We're gonna, we're just gonna suck on them. All right, here we go. So where is the, this might take some attempts, okay. So, whoop, nope. Alright. Nope. <laughs> that was probably the worst possible attempt that I could have made. Oh, it's back. Oh, I don't have to. Oh, it's respawns. Okay, nice. Hopefully, it continues to respawn because. This is showing that I'm not very good at what I'm trying to do. All right. So if I just kind of nudge it, if I can get ahead of it, maybe, just maybe. Ooh. I love the animation of Yoshi trying to shoulder the, the boulder. Ugh. I don't know if this is the intended way to do this, but it seems, seems like it's logical, right? Oops. <laughs> this is a little tricky. Then it is tricky to rock a rhyme on time. It's also tricky to jump off a Bow Wow stone. Okay. Try this for another minute or so. I feel like I'm not really doing what I need to do. Yet. Because I don't quite know. I keep hitting the ceiling. I feel like I need to like jump when I get to this second platform. Oh, there it goes. No? Maybe not? <laughs> Alright. So, a couple more attempts and then... I'm gonna... Have to... Oops! I'm gonna have to give a B right back. So, last try here. I didn't... <laughs> okay, everybody. I will return in a moment. Okay, everybody, I'm back. It appears that uh, what I was trying to do was not even close. So, instead, let's do it the right way. That is the bottom entry to this little catacombs. Little did I know there's an, an upper entry right here, which I apparently could not have figured out in this game for children. So there it is. Surprisingly, You'll also find the key! So, yeah. There you go. That's how you... That's how you solve this dastardly puzzle. I think I can just keep going from here. You need to actually replenish my eggs. Let's go and see if we can find that key door. Oh my goodness, these mice. Their animations are very cute. But that sound effect is one of the most annoying things. Oh boy. I didn't bring the key with me, and I gotta deal with these dumb hedgehogs. All right, let's let's just let's just settle down, guys. Okay? Sometimes in life, you you just gotta settle down. We're doing fine. Hopefully, we're all doing fine. All right. Let's zigzag the old. Oh boy, did I did I goof this? Can I not? I don't, uh... Can you... <sighs> okay. <laughs> Let's go ahead and respawn the Bow Wow Stone and try that again. It should just have enough momentum that it can kind of canoodle all on its own. Did I do it again? Oh, I did. <laughs> I got the mouse sounds taunting me in the background. All right, all right. This episode has gone on far too long for my buffoonery. There we go. You gotta get ahead of it. You gotta get ahead of your rolling stone sometimes. Then you can use it to crush small wildlife. As we all love to do. Okay, here we go. Now where is that gosh dang door? Let's find it. And get the H out of here. Oh boy. I've come too far. Nope. It's a bit of a gauntlet. Oh, I didn't mean to spin him out. I want to eat him. Oh, that was a mouse. Oh, my goodness. 
I dislike everything about this right now. <laughs> oh boy. I'm like, sort of trying to brute force it. Ugh. Oh, I need the... I need a rock. Can I get there from here? Oh, never mind. Oh. Please don't be worse. Just let me end this level in peace. Oh, thank goodness. I don't feel like I earned a bonus, but... And I... <laughs> the game agrees, so there you go. Okay. So that was something. But thankfully we were able to pull off the 100% again, so... That's great. All right. Thanks for following along, everybody. Thanks for subscribing and commenting and liking and all of those fun things. I'll see you next time for something brand spanking new. So thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D Mike. This has been Super Nintendo Sundays, Yoshi's Island. I'll see you later. Bye.